Thanks, Reshma. I'm here at the Arclight in Hollywood for the 6th Annual Indian Day Film Festival of Los Angeles. And tonight is the opening night gala of the 6th Day event. So let's see what they have in store for us this year. How does it feel to be here at the Indian Film Festival in Los Angeles? Feeling good. It's going to be really fun. It's great to be here. Woo! Nervous! I love it already, so <laughs> it's exciting. It's very cool to be here. Terrific. I've been saying that to all the cameras. Yeah, I've been super actually. But well, we're at the Arclight, which is an yeah. awesome... My favorite theater. cinema. How does it feel to have your movie premiere here tonight at the festival? It feels amazing. It feels amazing. Um, I was just saying that, that when we showed the short film that this was based on in 2005 here, a part of the reason we wanted to do the feature was because the short was, was received so well around the world. This was one of the major venues of that. What was the experience like working with Richie? He's so steadfast and so... In, deep in his art and so um, open and yet so um, solid with what he wants and de dealt with everybody individually that it was uh, one of the most impressive things I've ever seen from a young filmmaker. Tonight's movie, I'm, all, I'm really excited to see. I've heard really good things. I saw the short when it was here years ago and I really loved it and I'm just really looking forward to seeing it. My expectation is really to see what else is going on um, because I've never been to this particular event before. I'm, I'm extremely excited about the other films that are going to be shown. I'm very nervous because I haven't actually seen the film, which is a really stupid move to do, to see it with a you know live audience and stuff for the first time. But the good bit about it is that it's a phenomenal theater and so to see it like, you know, on a big screen rather than in a tiny little screening room and stuff. I just wanted to come and say hi to everybody really. Um, you know, I, I, don't, I don't know very many Indian filmmakers, so I'm excited to just go and meet everybody. I, I've, I've been to several film festivals and, uh, you know, there's, there's always this, you know, it, it's, it's good to, to do the carpet and kind of like get the word out about the festival, especially, you know, an Indian film festival from, from my point of view, it's, it's something that I support. How many times have you been to this Indian film festival? I've been here a few times, um, at least two or three, I can't remember. Anytime I'm in town, I'm here. I like to come and support, so if I'm here, I will be here. And how have you observed the progress to be every year? Better. Every year it's better, which is great. It's, it builds upon its strengths, fixes the stuff that might not win as great, and always has more, you know, in terms of a level film, in terms of how great they are, and the level of, of work and filmmakers and talent always gets greater and greater, which is really great. What do you think would be the reaction from an all-Indian audience? I don't think the, uh, the, the Indian Film Festival has only Indian audience, because last time I came, which was like five years ago, which was the opening year, in fact, majority of them were um, Americans and, and, and white Americans. Americans. In fact, even Tarantino watched a film last year. And I bought him a drink. So there you go. We might see him again this year. You have some great memories with the Indian Film Festival. <laughs> Absolutely. That's why I'm back. This festival plays a lot of films that you don't see, you know, right away at least. It's not picked up or whatever. And then perhaps in a while it does get distributed. What was the experience like producing Kissing Cousins? Oh man, Kissing Cousins. Wow. Um, I mean, it was it was hard. Making a movie is tough, and it's my first feature film. I've done two short films before this, and uh, as a producer, you know, you got to pull it all together. And it was it was a long, long journey. What do you expect the uh, reaction to be? Usually, people throw money at the screen. Uh, Jerry is naked in the film, uh, but only from the waist down for about 20 minutes of the movie, and that's usually when uh, the male audience leaves and the women stand up and applaud. Because that's because the male audience are very jealous of me. God give me something, this should be jealous, right? Yeah. That's how I look at it. Well, it looks like a lot of great movies are premiering at the festival this year. That's going to do it for me. I'll see you guys next time. Hi, this is Koal Puri and you're watching Showbiz India. Keep watching. I'm Sheetal Chef and you're watching Showbiz India.